In kidneys, we find two groups of nephrons. 80 to 85% of the nephrons in kidneys look like the nephron that we have in the left side of this model, and we name them cortical nephrons. And 15 to 20% of the nephrons in kidneys look like the nephron that we see in the right side of the model, and we name this nephron juxtamedullary nephron. In this model, I will summarize the main differences that we see between cortical nephron and juxtamedullary nephron. First, we start with the location of renal corpuscle. Please keep in mind that renal corpuscle includes the Bowman's capsule and the glomerulus that sits deep inside the capsule. When we look at the renal corpuscle of cortical nephrons, we see that the renal corpuscle sit in the outer part of the renal cortex. But the renal corpuscle of juxtamedullary nephrons are located in the deeper part of the renal cortex. The next difference would be the length of the nephron loop. When we look at the nephron loop of cortical nephron versus the nephron loop of juxtamedullary nephron, we notice that juxtamedullary nephron has a much longer nephron loop. The nephron loop extends into the deeper part of the renal medulla However, the nephron loop of cortical nephron extend only in the outer portions of the renal medulla. And then we notice the next difference would be in the ascending limb of the nephron loop. When we look at the ascending limb of the nephron loop of cortical nephron, we see that the diameter of the ascending limb is the same in every section. But when we analyze the ascending limb of nephron loop of juxtamedullary nephron, we notice at the beginning, the diameter of ascending limb is narrow, and then the diameter of ascending limb is wide. So the ascending limb of the nephron loop of juxtamedullary nephron is divided into thin ascending versus thick ascending. And please keep in mind that juxtamedullary nephrons have significant role in processes such as diluting urine or concentrating urine. So that would be something that when we learn more about the physiology of nephrons, we will discuss. But for now, the main differences between cortical nephron versus juxtamedullary nephron would be the location of renal corpuscle, the length of the nephron loop, and the presence of thin and thick ascending in the nephron loop of juxtamedullary nephron. But in the cortical nephron, we do not have thin and thick ascending. Hope you find this helpful.